What's up people, I'm Marcus B Gaming and we gotta talk about the Harazi Auto Rifle and some mean roll opinions. Thanks for clicking, drop a like anytime and let's go. Harad is a 360 RPM in the kinetic slot with stasis. It's got good vertical recoil and it has a big advantage over a lot of other autos. It has a scope, so it reaches out to 35 meters and more for its optimal range. It's an auto rifle that kind of thinks it's a scout, and if you use it that way, it's a beast. There's better autos up close, but give this baby a chance. Get some more stability and handling in there stats wise for the best results. You can only get Harad C from finishing up Gambit matches and hoping it drops. And know that after Season 16, you will be able to decode engrams for it at Drifter in the Tower 2. Now let's look at solid perks and rolls. Arrowhead Brake will control recoil and add 9 handling. Small Boar has 7 stability with 6 range. Corkscrew Rifling brings 5 stability, range, and 4 handling. Polygonal has 9 stability, and Hammer Forge has the same for range. In the mag slot, high caliber rounds add flinch and fire range. Armor piercing will do more shield damage over penetrate and add fire range. Ricochet rounds bounce have five more range and nine stability, and light mag reloads faster and has five more range. In the mix slot, perpetual motion boosts stability, handling, and reload while moving. Fourth times refunds two bullets for four crits. Stats for all will give more handling, stability, reload, and range for hitting three separate targets. Dynamic sway boosts stability for holding the trigger. Heating up brings more accuracy, stability, and better recoil for kills. And steady hands boost handling for all weapons after a kill. In the last slot, Demolitionist will help charge grenades for kills and reload when you use a grenade. Headstone will make a popsicle for precision kills. Borpal hits vehicles, bosses, and super guardians harder. One for all boosts damage for hitting three separate targets. Frenzy has more damage after 12 seconds of combat. Tap the trigger adds stability when you first pull the trigger. Moving target lets you move faster when aiming with better targeting. And multi kill click will stack more damage for reloading after rapid kills. For PvE, I want Arrowhead, Small Boar, or Hammer. High Cow or Armor Piercing, Perpetual 4 times or Stats, and Demo, Headstone with the right build, Vorpal, one for all if you roll Stats, or Frenzy. For PvP, Arrowhead, Small Boar or Poly, High Cow or Ricochet, Perpetual or Dynamic, and Moving Target, Tap or Multi. Oh and don't forget it comes with 2 traits, and a Stability or Handling Master will do you justice. It's a mean PvE auto and will do some work in PvP, but only at range. Just my opinion of course, but what do you think? Drop your opinion in the comments, like and a sub if this helped. Thanks, I'm out.